Hi viewers, today we will connect Java application with Oracle database through JDBC connection. We will use latest Oracle database Express Edition 18 and NetBeans 11. So let's start, first you make sure your database is running. We open NetBeans. We will create new project. Here we select simple Java application and click next. Here we give project name as JDBC and click finish. Wait for project to create. Project is created and it has default class file JDBC. Here we remove extra comment to clarify our code. We have to download Oracle Connection Driver JAR file from Oracle website. Open browser. Type Oracle JDBC driver and press enter. Click on first link. As we are using Oracle Database 18, we will download 18C driver. Here we download OJGKIT file and save it to our project directory. under resources now we include this JDBC file into our project open NetBeans right click on project click properties go to libraries and click on plus button in front of class path select jar folder and here we select file click ok now jar file included in our project next in our main jdbc class we create driver string url string user and password string now we create database url string
We created driver string. Here we created user and password. Now we create connection object and assign it to null, as we initialize object in try cache. Here we also make statement object and result set object. Now we write code in static main function. In catch portion we throw exception, if occurred. For this we also make function throwable exception. In finally, we will close all opened resources including connection. Here we call for driver. And initialize connection through driver manager. We pass URL, user and password to driver manager. Now we initialize statement with connection function. Now all basic things completed. We write here SQL query in string. And here we get result set. Check if result is returned. And here we print results returned by Oracle.
Here we put breakpoint at line. Right click on project and click on debug. Cursor stop at breakpoint. We press F8 button to continue next line. Now you can see result are printed in output. Thanks for watching.